Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. If you're new, welcome to the fam. If you aren't new, I'm sure you're here following my journey and how I got kicked out of nursing school. So today I am gonna be doing a little get ready with me. That's why I look rusty. But anyways, I just woke up. Um and I'm gonna talk about the HESI. I took my HESI, I passed, so that's good. I'm gonna talk about some of the resources that I use while I get ready. And yeah, I decided to change the setting a little bit because I'm always in my room, so I want to do get ready with me today. Okay, so usually the first thing I do in the morning is brush my teeth. Obviously, we don't want no stinky breath, so. <laughs> but, um contacts too but i put my contacts in off camera because your girl's blind well i only got one in so that i could see the video to record but yeah i'm about to brush my teeth i'm gonna speed it up because if i sit here and talk i'm gonna be late so i'm brushing my teeth y'all <laughs> Okay, so I put my contact in. That's why my eyes watering, but I um what the heck? I like to put these. What is this? Oh, this is not visine. This is clear eyes, cause my eyes they get red sometimes. So I'm gonna drop. I burn myself. Um, what was I making? I was making cupcakes, but yeah, let me put these. If y'all don't like stuff like this, I'm so sorry. So while I do this mask, I do this every morning because my face, my skin be tripping. Clearly, like, I don't know why, but I'm about to put this on. I'm running out, but this is what it is. It's probably not even good for me, but if I feel like it's good, then it's going to be good for me. I'ma use you. I'ma do that anyway. Okay. Uh, so while this dry, it's a peel off. So I'ma talk to y'all about my HESI and how I did and how I studied or my lack thereof studying. Who knows if I could get it out. There we go. Sometimes, sometimes this burn. It don't burn today. But some days, it do burn. I'm gonna speed this up for y'all so y'all know. We can get to the good stuff. Okay, so I actually took the HESI two years ago, right? 2020. I got my scores back here so that I could tell y'all what I got, but... Oh, three years ago. Oh, my gosh. So I actually took the HESI three years ago. The first time around, I only had to do um, the reading and math, I think. So I did grammar, vocab, and I did math. So on the reading portion, overall I scored a 90%. And then for math, I scored a 92%. It's not showing me specific like my, the grammar vocab, it just says reading composite. So 90% and then math, I scored a 92. So my overall was a 91. The first time that I took the HESI, actually I um, used this, uh, what was it? It was like a Facebook study group and when i tell you like the documents that they posted to study from were like word for word for all, like the exam like the study documents that they posted so that's how i did so well that time i have a very like i have a good memory so if i see something and i like recognize it i'm able to like recognize it on the exam too so it's kind of weird if that makes sense 
So the first time, that's how I study. It was a Facebook group. I don't know if it's still a thing. I don't even remember the name of it, but that's how I did so well the first time. So this time around, I took it on Wednesday. I think it's Friday now. Yeah, it's Friday. And um, I was supposed to vlog the experience, but it got a little bit hectic. So if you, if I haven't said it, which I think I have, I live in Michigan and we got a really bad snowstorm for like a couple days. I think it's so funny that I'm talking to y'all while I look like this, but we can keep going. Anyways, we got a lot of snow. So, um, I was originally supposed to go to campus and take it, but I ended up having to take it at home. And it was like on Proctor U, which I'm not familiar with, but y'all might be. So, um, we did that. And then, um, I was supposed to be scheduled to take it at, at noon. But when I logged in to like register or you know, to take it. They only had an 11.10 slot. Mind you, it was 11.09, sweetie. Like, <laughs> so I'm calling the admission advisor, like, what do I do? She like, well, can you take it right now? Or do you need more time? And I'm like, you know what? I just want to get over it. So I'm gonna take it. So the grammar, yeah, the grammar, no, the read it and the vocab part was like I think there are 55 questions the anatomy part was 30 questions and then the um okay the math part was 55 questions too the reading comprehension my overall was an 85 um the anatomy and physiology portion <laughs> um I got I'm 56 percent and the math, I got a 94%. And my overall was an 80%, but the advisor told me that they waited. So my overall, I don't know how, but it was 85. So I went down 6%, which is pretty good considering that I didn't study. But when I went into it, she looked at my previous scores and she was like, oh, like you're reading. And your math were really good, so just focus on the anatomy. You think I listened? Clearly I did not, but I mean, I still passed. I needed a 60% overall to pass, and I got an 85, so that's good. But um, what I did go over, so I used like some Hesse Quizlets. I used, um, uh, I can't remember the name of it, but I'm gonna throw it on the screen because I don't remember. And then I'll also link it down below. They had like some practice exams for the HESI to do. And I think those are really helpful. Um, YouTube, 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 YouTube. So um, there was a math video, a HESI math video that I did and pretty much like that was really helpful. Um, and then specifically for the anatomy and physiology part, like, I thought I wouldn't really like need to freshen up on those things, but clearly I did. I kind of just like breezed through it, but that was where I left. Um, so my recommendation would be doing those practice questions, YouTube specifically. Um, I know some nursing schools, like they have a chemistry portion. So if you have to do that, like you can find so many resources online that are free too. So. That's that. For this HESI, there was like no specific way that I studied. I had a week to study and I chose to like study. When did I start studying? I think I started studying like the Friday before. So I did a couple YouTube videos and I um, made some notes. But overall, I would say for the math, like it's mainly algebra, proportions, fractions, things like that. Um, and then the vocab one, you just have to choose the word or you have to choose the meaning. And then with the reading, um, they give you a passage, a passage and then you have to answer the question about the passage. So it's pretty straightforward. It's like your knowledge from a high school level. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all that I have. Um, I'm gonna let this mask dry. 
and then I'll be back to finish my get ready with me. Okay, I don't know why, but for some reason, today, this thing is taking forever to dry. But I got dressed. I can't even move that so y'all can see my outfit. I'm too short. I'll show y'all. And I'm going to show y'all outside because it's a lot of snow at the end of this video. But yeah, still waiting for it to dry. <laughs> it started peeling, but it's not dry. See? Okay, I'm gonna just start peeling it because if I don't, your girl is going to be late. So we're just gonna peel it off. And then I'll wipe the rest off for whatever is not dry because it's taking too long. And I'm trying to be on time, okay? Not on BP time. This side is the side I put on first and it did not dry at all. Like, come on, stop playing with me. Don't play with me. I'm just about to peel it off. Okay, so while I wait for my face to dry now, I don't usually wear makeup, but for the sake of this video, we're going to do it. We're going to have a little fun, get a little spunky. I actually, even when I wear makeup, I don't wear a lot of it. So I cover up these little blemish marks and then I put foundation under my eyes because I feel like it made me look more alive. And then I put it here and right here. I don't know what I'm doing. So if I'm putting it on room, mind your business. <laughs> But I use this Estee Lauder. Um, the girl in Ulta matched me, so I don't even know. But I'm shade rich. It's rich ginger or five and one. But this is what it looks like. And I got this. I would damp it, but I'm kind of in a rush right now. I need to hurry up. So we're going to do it really quick. And I'm going to show y'all the snow, and that's going to be the end. So that's done. Now I'm going to put on a little bit of mascara and I'm waiting closer to Valentine's Day to get my eyebrows done because the last person that did them like, she did them real thin. So we will thin it out so that they can grow back. They don't look that bad, but they definitely need to be done. So I like my eyebrows, not really thick, but like, you gotta have a little bit of volume, you know, like, it wasn't given.
So I'm gonna take this off. Ooh. I gotta fix that. <laughs> okay, I actually don't have time to do my edges. I gotta go. This is so realistic, but I'm gonna do my edges in the car. So, I'm sorry. I'm gonna show y'all the snow still. But if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you aren't subscribed, please subscribe and follow me on my journey. And I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.